Hello guys, good evening. I know it's late, it's 10 o'clock, but I wanted to do a video. Um, and it's on something that's really, really, really close to right, well, close to right, my favourite. Um, and it, it, it's something that cheers me up because today is, is the celebration of the wave of light, um, which is near, uh, stillborn basically pregnancy and infant loss and then tomorrow is my dear you can't even see because the camera's not there uh hang on two minutes my dear mum's birthday so yeah i might do a video but sorry guys tomorrow on some or i don't know um for my mum i'm not sure but yeah i'm gonna be putting up before this i'm gonna be putting up my wave of light um video which I put I, I lit my candle at seven so anyway this one is on my face masks um now I've become in the last month I've become a lover of sheet masks um my face absolutely loves sheet masks as you can see my skin is so clear and that is because I've gone from mud masks which seemed to work for me in the summer sort of season to using sheet masks and then once a month i'm gonna use a mud mask i'm not wasting my mud masks um so i thought that i would go through and show you the masks that i've got at the moment and then maybe once a month if i get new ones um i'll do um a video showing you what new ones i've got um i used Two, uh, cat one, and another one. I can't remember what it was. Um, but the newer sheet masks I got from Savers and yeah, Savers because the ones I got from Home Bargains I've used. Um, but I will try to tell you where I've got each mask from. Anywho, um, so whoops, sorry guys. So the first one I'm going to show you is one I got from Savers and it's the Manuka Honey um, uh, Vitalizing Sheet Mask um, and it is just a, gen like a generic white mask um, and I really really like this, this is with um, Skin Treats and I'm, I heard about this brand, but I've never tried them. And when I saw them, these were a pound. When I saw them, I had to pick them up. Um, so, yeah, this is um, so relatively in the UK, made in South Korea. So, yeah, I've got the Manuka Honey one. And then these are 75p in Savers. The Seven Heaven uh, Dead Sea Treat Mask. Montani well it's that brand i can never say that brand um and this is for uh, carmine and cleansing and you get one sheet mask in there uh, five minute beauty fix use weekly and it's got top seaweed crushed dead sea salt and pressed red algae so that one and this one is also 75p this is a tea tree one. Um, stimulates and wakes up skin. Uh, another seven heaven one. Um, and it's got a sea, uh, squeezed bear, bear berries. Bear, bear, bear berries. Pressed tea tree and crossed ferment. And yeah, that was 75p. And this was a pound. And it is so cute. Um, and it's uh, again from Skin Treats. Um, a lot of uh, you basically you might forget this brand, because that brand, or Skin Treats in Savers. Well, we might say as you do. Um, and this um, is the Pretty Panda Super Hydrating Skin Sheet Mask. Um, and this is. 
There it is, and you can see it's got printed, it's printed on it, um, and it is a sweet coconut scented. And I really, really like this. Well, I've not found um, a sheet mask that has made my skin go all funny um, or sting or go all red, in anything. Look at this. I mean, I can't believe how, how clear my skin is. Um, and then I've got another one of these skin treat ones that were pound in savers. I love the fact they're all white. Um, my new candy one said nourish and soothe, and this one says nourish and moisturize. And this is the ch uh, chai calming sheet mask. Um, and yeah, again, in Korea, I, I can't wait to try these. Um, and another one I got from Savers for a pound is the Kiwi Refreshing Sheet Mask. Um, and I, I can't, I really, I can't wait to try these. I've got, um, four coming from Avon, but I'm not putting the Avon order until next week. Um, so, um, and I do a sheet mask every Tuesday, so... I won't be buying any more for a while because I've basically got one, two, three, four, so I've got a month and a half and then I've got like two months worth, um, but I do like to, and I've got some other ones in here, I do like to have them, you know, stocked up. Um, then I've got a Dr. Botanicals uh, Po Pomegranate Superfood Regenerating Sleep Mask. Um, dirty mouth. This came from Glossy Box. Um, not used it if I'm honest, cause um, the sleep mask sometimes if Crystal wakes up, um, we go through the bed, or I I I I forget sometimes, and I I just put my moisturizer on. Um, so yeah, cause you've got to wipe it off in the morning, and with Crystal, you don't always get time. To, um, I do wash my face, but it says I have to wash it off in the morning after, uh, in a certain time bracket. And obviously, with Crystal, I've got a baba. I don't always get time, so I've got that one. I have got some skin oils in that, which I'll show you after. I've got this one, I've got a backup. I've got to get rid of this one. <coughs> I've got another, a new one. This one's practically gone, as you'll see. This is the Clean Skin by Avon Pore and Shine Control. Black mineral mask with witch hazel and eucalyptus extract. This is um another mask. Um, but um, what I mean another mask? This is another mask that doesn't bring back red. It's a clay mask, but it doesn't bring me out red. Um, none of the evil ones seem to. Um, I don't know. Um, as you can see, it's grey, and then it dries like a bluey. Sort of bluish white off white color, um, and that's the only know when it it's due to come off. But yeah, I I I, I like that. Avon seems to be my go to for masks. Um, and this is another clear skin one by Avon. This is the blemish clearing jelly um, blemish clearing O2 fresh jelly mask. And this is a weird weird like. It looks like a cream, but it is, it wobbles like a jelly. It's really, really weird. Um, I do like it. Um, I've got to say, actually where I said that the Avon, all the Avon masks, they bring me up red. This one does a tad, but then it goes away, obviously, as soon as I put my moisturiser on. It's time to put my moisturiser on. It is really, really good. Um, I just don't use it very often simply because I've got other ones that I favour over this one. Um, so I've got that one. That's the treatment. I've got a mask. Then I've got the Clear Skin Blackhead Clearing Deep Treatment Mask, which um I don't think they do anymore. Um, and this one goes on. Like a bluey, uh, bluey colour, and then 
so that's white. I really like this one. It's my favourite. Um, I think out of the clay sort of masks. Um, and yeah. And it was quite a good price as well, if I remember rightly. Then this is the first mask I ever tried from Avon. This is the Planet Spy Perfectly Purifying with Dead, Dead Sea Minerals Face Mask. And this one comes back every now and again, and I just pick it up next time it comes in a catalogue because it's not like they do more sheet masks now than they do uh, tube masks, and they do more peel off masks than. We do cheap masks. I don't like pain off masks. Um, to be honest with you. And then I've got, so that's not, that's a hand cream. And then I've got a mud masky. Um, facial detoxifying, purifying, sorry, detox, purifying, recovery mask. I like this one. If I'm breaking out or I'm having a really bad time and I've got, my skin's really bad. This one's not going to open. This is a. Um. This is. It looks like it's. <laughs> uh, this is the other one, new, newest one I got. Um. I, I did have to. Uh. I find this is really good. It just brings the soft skin back to life. Uh. That's a treatment. <laughs> then I have the uni uni uh, uni um whatever it is <laughs> UNA and I uh thermo defense face mask this goes really really well alongside the uh illuminate milk cleanser so I use those two together it's a clear face mask. That's it. Whoa! Sugar size Can I have that towel, please? Dad, can I have that towel, please? That's because it's a clear mask. It's also very. Very watery mask. Um, so I don't, that, that, that's one of the reasons I don't use it very often. You can hear it sussing about. It's a very, and it doesn't dry very well either, so I don't use it very much. Then I have a mud mask in Leave Me On winter mask, which I got. When did I get it? When did I get it? It might have been last Christmas, I'm not sure. Or January, I think it might be actually. Um, and you basically just leave it on. Um, during the day, you put it on and it protects you from all the winter baddies and stuff. Um, so that would be one that I would properly try in. And then I've got a little mud masky one. This is a seat repair renewal nourishing mask. And I think I've actually um, tried this once. Um, yeah, I think I've tried it once. It's a white, off white cream kind of. So, yeah. Another one that I think I've maybe tried once. I'm not too sure. But it, again, it's a hard one to try with. Little Miss About. Um, and then I've got a Boots Cucumber Clay Mask, a 5 minute, is it 5 or 3? Three? 3 minute wonder. I do like this one. Um, whereas the Super Drug Zone one I gave to a friend in the end because it just made my face, it was meant to be for sensitive skin, it had a little mirror in it, but it still brought my face out red. So, yeah, I'm going to be coming to a friend in the end. This one I really like. Um, I feel just need refreshing um, as well. And then we get on to the packet masks. Uh, we have a super drug, detoxifying dead sea mineral 
mask for cleaner, more vibrant complexion. Uh, seaweed extract, and this is for normal to oily. And then we've got a cooling, sorry, a cucumber cooling clay mask. I do have a sense of skin, I really like these. I did remember when I first tried this one. Um, I did a video, I had to do a video on it, I loved it so much on my old channel. Um, Dead Sea Minerals, I can remember extract, refresh and save skin. I really like it. And these are clay masks again. Um, De-stress mud mask for uh, revered self, a healthy looking complexion. And this is for no water combination. Um, and I bought those three. Sorry, I'll go over and tell you why I got each one from me as I put them back in, I guess. This is a tea tree with witch hazel. Sorry, tea tree, witch hazel, um, with activating charcoal. Intense deep cleansing face mask. The top, the top to fire in this face mask. Yeah, and this is a, uh, mud mask. Then we have a multivitamin radiance complexion face mask. And this is a sheet mask, I think. Yeah, this is a sheet mask. Um, from this brand down here, which I can never read. Um. <coughs> And that one came from Glossy Box. Then I got this one here. And I had two and I gave one to a friend. Um, and you basically, you get your spatula and your mask. And you've got to add water to it and make it yourself. So that's why I'm not used to it. I can't be bothered with all that bath when I'm... I, I do my face mask when I get in the bath or over my best friend myself when she comes over, so I can't be asked with all that fat, to be honest. So that's why I've not done that one. Then this one is a, another sheet mask. This is a Good Morning AM mask. Um, and you put it on in the morning. And it gives you a bright complexion, but I don't have the time. That one came in a cozy box, I believe. And this is a 111, not the emergency outline, but a 111 skin at Harney St. London. Gold brightening face treat, facial treatment mask. Um, and this is the one I'm doing next. Um, and it's another sheet mask. Um, and then I've got two of the same ones because they came in two separate glossy boxes. Um, this is a hydro face mask at 120 hours, um, hours of hydration with AMF, artificial moisture factor. And this is in Rio of Janeiro, uh, Jericho, sorry, R Rose of Jericho, uh, Jericho extract, Jericho. And future of um, resonation in the skin. So, there we go, and I've got two, and that's from that brand again. So, these came from Glossy Box. This one came from my Glossy Box. This one came from my Glossy Box. This one came from my Glossy Box. So, that in a second. Um, this one came from my Glossy Box. This one came from a glossy box. These, this one I bought. That one I bought and that one I bought. This one came from a glossy box. On a diff in a different box to that one. But they both came in a glossy box. This one I bought. This one I bought, and I've got another one. This one I bought. 
that one I bought. That one came in a glass box. That one came in a glassy box. That one came in a glassy box. That one came in a glossy box. That one I bought. Right, now I've got some other treatments and things. This one's the hand cream, the ritual of Adria. Um, Seaman hand balm, I love that. Um, these are Garden Angel Vitalizing Eye Pads. And they came from a glossy box as well. And then I've got the Vine Hydrate Gel Lip Mask from Beauty BL3D. Then at the front, I have a After Mask Vitamin Serum, which I do try when I remember to put it on when I get out of the bath after I've used the face mask. Before I put on my moisturizer, I've got a little dental skin cleanser from Cadaphil. Centerfield, however you want to say it. Um, I've got a little glove to put on my face mask, but I never remember that. Um, then you've got this, which is being chucked because this isn't the colour it was when I first got it. So this is gone actually. This is the stripped rose hip and mandarin moisturising oil. Um, this is Dr. Mechanical's Moroccan Rose Super Facial Oil. And then this is from Mo, 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 Mo New Skin Firming 3D Face Oil for Dry Sensitive Skin. Um, and even though I've just showed you those, they're going to be tucked as well. Because I don't. I've had them for a while. Um, and then, like I said, all of these I bought. So, yeah, that prompts me to go through stuff. So, yeah. I hope you enjoyed seeing my face mask. Um, I absolutely love pampering and stuff like that. Um, so, yeah. I'm gonna love you and leave you. And I will see you in my next video. Stay safe, wear a mask if you can. Keep smiling and remember, never let anyone get you down. Bye guys.